Good day, good day, good day, lovely people. How are you? So in today's YouTube, I am going to be showing you how you can install leftover fingernails. Yeah, they don't all have to be the same color. If you want them to be, you can. But I'm going to dive in and show you how you can use press on nails. Now, I used to go and get my nails done. I don't anymore. So what I do now, I use and press, press on nails, if you will. So with that being said, I still have some left over. And I am going to be using my leftover nails. I might have different colors or I might keep them all the same color or I may not. So I have this pretty blue. It's like a electric blue, if you will. I have that color and I'm going to tell you guys something about this. Using press on nail really, really last. And I'm going to teach you guys, or show you, not teach, I'm going to show you guys a secret as to how they can last long. Okay? So these are the nails that I had left over from when I used them um, previously. So I have my, my wine color, if you will. I have my gray with silver. And then this wine color have this glitter right here, which is so pretty. Then I have this silver with this gray. That's that blue. And then in here you get some silver here. Okay. Then you have, I have these on Christmas. This is a cute color. Cute, nice little powder blue. This one comes with full white. And then it also has this silver inside here. And then you have this blue right here. So I am going to show you guys how to install these press on nails um, with the crazy glue. Now, let me tell you something. You have to get the press on nails that has the sticky part on. If you don't get the press on nail with the sticky part on, it will last, but it won't give that a, give it a lasting um. It won't last long. This, when I put the sticky part on, um, pull the, 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 the tab off and then put the glue on and then glue it down. Ladies, let me tell you, my nails stay on for like two weeks and a half or it could go longer. But I'd be so eager to um, try different colors. I pull them off myself or I would try to pick them off myself, but they last long i'm trying to tell you ladies they last long so what i am about to do you're going to see me um cleaning my nails i'm going to use some nail polish removal just to clean it just to get the grease if you will off of my nail okay so i'm going to use this nail polish removal to get the grease off now i would have cleaned it up but some of my nails they look good I, some of them i don't have to clean around them some of them i probably have to but we're just gonna go ahead on and just take off the grease because i had lotion in my hands so you want to make sure that your nails are um not greasy you want them to be um I don't want to say dry, but you want them to uh, not be greasy, if you will. We don't want no residue of anything of the sort on. So what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to find me some nails so I can put on here. I think I want to do um, some blue. Um, maybe some blue and gray. I don't know. I'm not 100% sure of which one. But these are my blues here, and my light blues there, my grays here, and my wine. I love this color. This color is so pretty. This is a nice fall color and winter color, but this blue, I'm telling you, 
ladies this blue is is everything it's everything so i am going to be installing these nails and oh also um the gray come with this marble color as well one thing about these presto nails ladies i'm telling you you can get so many different um styles and designs and colors um if you will so let's get started measure not measuring out but getting the nails that fit me best i think i might do a color i don't know so let's just see i'm just loving this blue right here maybe i might do the light blue and the dark blue or the gray that's what i'll do i'll do some gray and i'll do the blue so i'm gonna put the wine and the, the um that one to the side and i'll just do some gray and the blue so i'll just keep these here oops i'll put these to the side and i'll go ahead on and use these okay so this is what i'm going to be working with these right here i'll push these over to the side and i'm going to be working with these so i'm just going to go through and find the one that fits my nails and then i'm going to install them that's how simple and easy it is so when you pull this off this is the the sticky part for your nail so you could put it on there but before i do that i always like to measure to make sure that it fits my finger now i always get the medium because i am a nurse i make sure that my nails are not long so i'm always looking for um short length up here you see a s it says um as for the short length so i'm always looking for the short length and it's so I, it's very manageable i can um do a lot of stuff with my nails being short versus them being long so one thing you do you try to make sure you they fit your nail okay and then you press them down to make sure that it's covering your nails okay so that one really didn't cover as well so this one doesn't and you could just flip it around and play with it however you want okay and you could tell I, I have worn these, so I had to peel them off because I was just, like I said, I was so eager to use other um, colors. But they are super, super cute. I love them. They let, like I said, they last long. Okay, so here go a nice fit right here. But see, sometimes because I have already used these nails, um, my thumb. I had already okay well here we go and then where you see like the little rough edge that's what you have to do is take your fingernail file and file it down okay I love these nails they are so pretty they're so pretty okay so that one fits that finger um okay so here we go a bigger thumb this one okay so this one must fit this finger okay so that one fit that finger so i'm just gonna line up my nails that fit both of my hands so these are my thumbs okay so these are my thumbs um i have that one on <laughs> put that to the side and put that to the side and you can also reuse the ones that you have already used so you can reuse those. Okay. And make sure when you put them on that you're pushing them down in your cuticles. Okay. Yeah, that one is a good fit for that one. I said I want to switch it up. So I really shouldn't have did that one with that one. I'll do this one with this one. And then I'll find a great one to fit this one. Okay. Okay, have to fit that. I want to incorporate a silver one in here. So let's see. Okay, that one with that one. Okay. 
Okay, so that goes here, but this is a different color. See the color? They different. So let's say. Okay, we're gonna do this one because I'll say but we have three on both sides, okay? So we just need to find these two right here. All right, so I did a gray, a blue, I did a blue, a gray, so I'll go ahead and try to find a uh, um a blue one to fit that finger right there, which this one is a little bit wider. So there we go. That one, and then I'll find um I'll do a blue pinky because over here I can do two. I'll do a blue pinky because over here I could do two grays. Okay. So okay. So we might need that one. Uh -huh. See that one is just a little bit too big. Um, okay, so we'll do that one. All right, so we can move all the blue out the way, and now we're just working with the gray. Oops. Okay, so need to find this one and that one in the gray. You can move the silver out the way as well. Okay, so I need to find this finger and this finger. So let's see. Perfect. And then this finger. So, hmm. That one is just a little bit too big. This one maybe. Hmm. No, I think this one, yeah, I think this one is good right here. So, might be. Might be just a little bit too big. Might be just a little bit. Cause if I get this one, see, I'm looking at these two pinky ones, and this one is smaller. Okay, there we go. Now, huh, we can stop installing. Okay. All right, so now that we have that out the way, we can start installing. So I'm going to do this hand first, and then I'm going to move over and do this hand, okay? All right. Pull my tab off, because that's my sticky part. Get my glue. And I like crazy glue because it, it holds a little bit longer. So what I do, I put a dot here and then I just circle it around so I can get all of my nail. And when I tell you this lasts long, it lasts long. Put that there. And it's this way. I'm going to start from here and I'm going to push it right in there. I'm going to hold it on. Okay, push that down. And the Empress nails, they have so many different colors. They have different lengths. Like I said, I like the short ones because it's more manageable for me when I do um, go to work and um, do hands-on with my patients. 
So I like wearing the short um, nails. And then also when I'm doing my charting or whatever I'm doing, it's, um, it's easy for me to type on the computer and um, put my gloves on without them ripping. Okay, so that one is good here. I'm going to move on to my index finger. Oh, let me take my tab off first. Lay that down on the side. Put my dot in the middle and just work it around until my whole entire nail has been covered with the crazy glue. Remember to push it under the cuticle, smash it down. So sometimes when you take those tabs off, they get in the way, in the way. So you push that down. It coming along pretty good, ladies. I need to go to the store and get some more. So I think I may do another. I'm not another, but I think I may do a YouTube blog of going purchasing my nails. And ladies, when I tell you these nails do not come off, believe me, they do not come off. They do not come off. So I'm going to pull this one off. Turn it over like this. Circle it around. Okay, you don't have to gunk it on there, but you can just put, like I said, that little dot. Start from here. Push it in that cuticle. Hold it down. Give it a little press. Okay. And like I said, these are just nails that I have already... Um, use but they are just the left so these are the leftover nails um that i have already used because in each box you get 30 nails in each box you get 30. so of course you're going to have some leftover nails after you finish after you have used your um first set of 10. take this one off of here Turn this over. Make sure you push it under the cuticle. Let's see how I look underneath. See how I look underneath. Hold it down. You're not holding it down for too long. You can count to ten and then you can let it go. Go back over it again, count to five, just to give it a little press down. And I'm going to tell you, ladies, if you try this, please comment in the comment box, I mean, in the, in the comment section, and let me know how long your nails stayed on your fingers, okay? I know you're going to tell me they've been on there for a long time, but you got to remember to get the press on nails, Okay. Don't get the nails that does not have the glue on them. Make sure you have the glue on them because it gives it the extra hold that you need when you are um, working, shopping, doing your kids' hair, um, whatever the case may be. Make sure you get the press on that has the... Um, the tape underneath okay and because I am a nurse you know we wash our hands often so with that being said you can wash your hands as many times as you prefer or you need and you don't have to worry about your nails 
falling off. Ladies, when I tell you that this worked because I was using just the regular um, nails without the um, the press on, without the, the tapered um, press on. And I said, why my nails keep popping off? I'm not understanding why they keep popping off. Ladies, please excuse my cuticles. I'll do a, another video with me cleaning up my cuticles. So please excuse that. But I said, I'm not understanding why they keep popping off. So then I did a little nail research, if you will. Oh, wow. She had took this off. So I did a little nail research, if you will. And I came to the conclusion that you have to... Get the one that has the glue on it and it stays on there long. Now, I may do a video with long nails just so you can see how they look and um, how to um, put those on too. But I'm not a long nail person. I cannot operate my business because I have my side business. I, um, I make jewelry and um, I can't sell or make my jewelry with... Um, long nails i just can't so those nails will be all in the way and i'll be trying to find a little fine piece to stick okay such as this bracelet that i made okay so if my nails on it some people can work with long nails but i can't but when i'm trying to be these on here it's it's just hard for me to maneuver with longer nails but um yeah I like the short. I prefer the short nails. I really do prefer the short nails. Okay. So that's the thumb. Moving on. I try to put a circle on there. Okay. I don't know why I'm, I'm not taking this off. You want to make sure your nails are lined up right, ladies. Like, make sure they're not twisted going this way or that way. You want to make sure that they are lined up um, perfectly. So, you want to hold it and count it for, to 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Let it go. You can go back over this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Just hold them down, but... They, they're not going anywhere. Trust me when I tell you these things. They're not going anywhere. So let me take this off because I didn't take that off on the other one. And when you get your nails, ladies, that's, a, you know, with the 30 in them, don't throw them in the trash. You can always mix and match. You know, summertime is coming up. So if you get nice summer colors and um, you use your first set of 10, keep them because you know how um, you can... I call it the Skittle effect. You can do the Skittle effect with the different colors. I think that is really, really cute. So keep your nails, ladies. Keep your nails. Push that down. I see that one almost went crooked. <laughs> Hold that. Mm, it look a little crooked. And before it dry, if you want to position it or shift it, make sure you do it before it dries because when it dries, it dries. And you have to walk around with a crooked nail. And nobody want to walk around with a crooked nail. I know I don't. But I think that one's kind of shifted. But it's okay. It's, it's, it is what it is. Okay. Going on to my next nail. Put the to the side. Sometimes these tags they can be a nuisance. <laughs> they don't want to let you go. And then you know what the ladies, it saves time of going to the nail salon and getting your nails done. I'm not knocking nobody that goes to the nail salon, but I'm gonna tell you for me, 
sometimes and I go there and sometimes they don't do what I asked them to do. Sometimes they cut it down too far or they shape it the way they want it to be shaped. And that's not what I asked for. So I said, it has to be another way. It's too many pretty press on nails out here for me to be giving these nail shops money. And you know, nails, they went up. It is like this. Everything is COVID prices. Everything have went up since the COVID. So when you can get a full set for $25, $30, if you're just getting a regular color on there, yeah, it's no more $25, $30. You're paying $40. Um, and who wants to do that when you can buy these nails for as little as $6.99 or $8.99? I had got a sale, buy one, get one free. This was um, right after Thanksgiving, so I racked up on two of them. So you look for that sale, just like you would look for the sale with your clothes. You look for your sale with your nails. But again, I'm just going to keep restating and reiterating please make sure you get the press on nails that have the sticky part because that right there will allow your nails to have a long lasting life okay so you push this in underneath that cuticle slide it down press it down count to 10 and voila Ladies, when I tell you these nails ain't going nowhere, they not going anywhere. They are here for the long haul. Unless I pull them off and I will do another one. I am going to come back and do another YouTube with the long nails. Now, when I put them long nails on because I'm going to be using this crazy glue. Oh my goodness. It may be on there for a minute. But, um... <laughs> Oh, Lord, I know it's going to be on there for a minute because this, it stays on. So, ladies, here it goes. How I look underneath. This is how I look underneath. And this is how I look. So, what I do have to do, if you see these little ridges right here, you just take your nail file and you file them right there. And you'll be on, to, you'll be on the go for the day. Thank you so much, ladies, for tuning in to my YouTube. And remember... Impress nails, they have the best um, style and collection of nails. You get 30 in a box. I have got, I got the short length, the ones that has the S on it. Um, and remember, it has to be press on nails. Remember, pull that tab off, fit your nails to your finger, put a dot of crazy glue on it and swerve it around make sure you have glue on your whole entire nail and once you finish with that press it on there count to 10 and you are on the way to a beautiful hand look such as myself thank you ladies so much for tuning in bye bye